Microsoft has launched their Microsoft Loop, a business management and collaboration tool, and recently Notion integrated AI functionality. But how do they stack up? Let's compare MS Loop and Notion AI side to side. Hey, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video, if you would like to try any one of these apps out, then you can do so from the description below. Microsoft Loop is like a newbie in the town, while their MS Office is being widely used in workspace scenarios from decades. But as the technology evolves, it didn't catch up with that. And that's where Notion took the advantage. It solves a lot of problems and in recent years, it has become a very popular tool so Microsoft has to do something about it so they launched MS Loop. So let's start by talking some of their features. Talking about Notion AI first it provides multiple features like fixing spelling and grammar, explaining documents using AI, translation between different languages, editing voices and tone of your content, make your write-ups shorter or longer and converting write-ups into simpler forms, simpler languages, and so on. Coming to Loop, the Copilot provides similar AI features like Notion. However, Loop has components which can be shared across workspaces and also across all MS Office apps. Basically, Loop content stays updated wherever you have shared it, even Outlook Mail. Anyways, Loop's integration with MS Office as well, I think it makes it very interesting proposition for the people in that ecosystem. Both of them have similar UI, although MS Loop looks like new and fresh since it was recently launched. Now here are some of the pros with some cons to look at. Microsoft has integration with their co-pilot in Loops, which is their chat GPT based AI. Unfortunately, it is very limited for now, whereas in the Notion AI, it is totally available and all the new features are being added gradually. In Loop, it has a feature to scan all your documents throughout Office apps, which makes it easy to find, share and edit using Copilot. In Notion, you do have files option, but of course you can't get the advantage of Office app. In Notion though, there are various workspace templates which makes it more user friendly than Loop and hence provides you more control on the workflow. Now coming down to the pricing, MS Loop preview is free for now and most likely will be included in their MS365 subscription, whereas Notion has free version plus plan at $8.15 per month for business plan that is built annually. But to include the AI functionality, you have to shell out some extra bucks. This is clearly a big cost for individuals. In conclusion, if you are already paying the MS365, MS Loop is free add-on that will help you the way you work. On the other hand, Notion is ready to use platform with the built-in templates and a huge supporter community. Ultimately, the choice is yours. If you are interested in any of these tools, you can check it out from the description below. And if you want to check out some new AI content, then you have to click the subscribe button. That's it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Like, share, subscribe. Stay safe. Bye-bye.